Big it, look at that big it. On everybody fishing the odds here I'm out with Kelly and frugal fishing today is simply about testing out the new frugal spins every single rod is rigged up in a frugal spin um, you can talk to Mike about the theory behind these but it's pretty cool um, last week we got like six takedowns all week and they're all on frugal spins so so we're not even messing around with those assignments today um, doing Mike a favor you know Doing Gretel a favor, doing doing Kelly a favor, doing our, ourselves favors for those spins. So enjoy the video, guys. Wish us luck. I walk around some ancient city, riding my notebook. Drink my tea Don't have to make love Cause love made me And I'll be happy Just by Another myself Another nice fish, Alex hey, 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 hey. He's right there, he's a schnook I'll make my skin on that left side, Bob. Oh, right there, right there. Got one? Yep. Okay. Kelly, get that rod there. Run it toward me. Yeah, get it out. Get it out of the way. Got the net. I got it right here. It's here. Don't grab, don't, not yet. Oh my god, big. Get, get, get the thing. Get it that way. Hey, frugal spin. Woo! Yeah! Nice. I know a river in Idaho. I'll catch a big truck and let him go. And I'll be happy just by myself. Alright, guys, just a little update here. Out with Mike and Kelly, of course, and got a takedown. Not a false snuck. He's 15, 16 pounds, something like that. Couldn't get a uh, length on it, but, anyways, caught him on the frugal spin. That's the important part here. Um, I'll, I'll post Mike's whole theory behind this frugal span in the description, and, I'll, and uh, you guys can check that out. But I was fishing 30 feet here, and I was fishing 28 feet on this rod. All five of these rods have a frugal span. This rod has a dodger and a frugal spin, so we're trying a little bit different tactic, but all the other rods have pro tools. Um, we're trying a little bit quicker speed today. Um, these, the fish and this, this smaller reservoir just seem to be a little bit more active, so. Um, all of our takedowns in the last week or so have been coming on faster trolling speeds. Anyways, guys, wish us luck. Hope we can get another fish in the boat. Oh, what the f is that? You got a fish? Yeah, dude. You got him still? Yeah. He's running toward me. That's cool. He's still there. Get that way. Good? Yeah. Good. Got him? Good, good. He's right there, he's a snook. Wild, wild snook. 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 Wild
fish second one of the day what did you catch it on i caught that on a frugal spin again that's the second fish that came on a frugal spin um not not to mention the, the fish that we lost on the frugal spin so i'm gonna give this guy a release real quick and get him back in the water I walk around some ancient city, riding my notebook and drink my tea. Don't have to make love. Yeah, buddy. Right there. Right there. Cause love made me. And I'll be happy uh -huh. I just by myself. He's a nice one. Oh, he's silver too. All right, baby. Another fish. This is our third fish today on a frugal spin, you guys. This is awesome. Oh, yeah. Just out here at Estacated Lake, just killing it. There's nobody else out here. Just having a blast. Here we go. You ready? That's how you do it, guys. Hey, bro, no. Just my socks. And I'll be happy. Just by myself. And I go fishing. Get with the flow. I know a river in Idaho. All right, guys, so that concludes the day. It's been a really good day. Only a couple hundred Chinook have come through this area, and we caught two of them today. Um, one of them was on my new rod and my new reel. I got this new Low Pro Akuma and Akuma Cold Water, and that was just a killer fight on this new reel. And uh, I got that paired up with some blue braid. Um, I believe that this braid is, is pretty invisible underwater, so um, that's that's something Mike and I have been talking about, the blue braid being, being a little bit more invisible than the green braid and things like that. So I got that first Chinook on this new setup, and then I caught that second Chinook on my 8'6", it's like a little steelhead rod. It, um, this thing buried, man. This thing went into the water on that second fish, but it handled it well. This is an 8'6", um, Lama Glass. It's, it's a lot lighter than, than your typical trolling rod, but, but it did the trick. You know, I haven't got my new Akuma that broke last week. Um, you guys can check that video out as well. I'll post it right up here on the card. Um, these fish came on frugal spins. The frugal spin has been hot out here today. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. Not even just today, last week and the week before that. We've been getting takedowns after takedowns on these frugal spins. Two fish proven landed today on those frugal spins. Um, Three fish I got takedowns on last week. They came off, unfortunately, but those were also on frugal spins. So this this rod, I have a two and a half foot leader um, behind my Pro Troll. That's a little long. Usually you run in, you know, between a foot and a half and two feet. That's generally what you kind of want to run. But this rod, I got a super short leader. I got an 18 inch leader on this rod. So the two different things I'm doing, they both caught fish. Um, Mike and I had gotten a little bit of argument earlier about he, he believes in the shorter leaders right now, and I believe in the longer leaders, and, you know, both of them produced today, so, you know, that just goes to show, man, everybody has got their different tools to the trade. There's a lot different way, a lot of different ways you can catch these fish out here, and um, we're just fortunate that we, we, we got into a pot of fish today, and uh, they're both wild, but it's a lot of fun, man. You guys got to get out, got to do some salmon fishing. So three fish, guys. I cannot believe this day. A remarkable day of fishing for Mike and I. Um, three Chinook in one day. You cannot tell me that's not good fishing. And we're still anticipating another bite out here on these fruitless fish. 
So, we just left. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Until next time, tight lines.